turn to this major highway headache on the horizon. Starting tonight, a large portion of I-75 is going to be shut down for the entire weekend. We're talking a five-mile stretch. Lauren Podell is there now with everything you need to know. I-75 in Oakland County doesn't shut down until 11 o'clock tonight, but construction crews, they're not wasting any time. The barricades are up and they're already hard at work cutting down the guardrail on the squirrel overpass. They have been since six this morning. This is the focal point of this weekend's construction because that bridge behind me is coming down. MDOT has big weekend plans for I-75 in Oakland County that may have you changing your plans. Get ready. Both directions of I-75 will close 11 p.m. tonight between Crooks and M-59. That's a five-mile stretch shut down so crews can demo the Squirrel Road overpass. So why is this happening? Remember that 16-year-long construction project MDOT announced? This is just one minor part of that $1.3 billion makeover a rebuilding bridges, rebuilding the pavement, taking a freeway again that's 50 years old and rebuilding it again to the modern standards design standards so it will increase safety, improve mobility. And while this particular closure will only last the weekend, the project as a whole will be broken down into eight phases, taking us to the year 2030. By doing two to three miles of construction, it's something that's reasonable. You can seek alternate routes instead of doing all 18 miles at once. That is just not feasible. So let's get you around this construction. MDOT says northbound traffic should take northbound Crooks to westbound M59 back to 75. Southbound traffic, you hop on eastbound M59 to southbound Crooks and then get back onto I-75. The good news is, as I mentioned, the freeway will be back open by Monday at 5 a.m. But what won't be here, this Squirrel Road overpass. Reporting from Auburn Hills, Lauren Podell, Local 4.